All right, this is a walk around video for a Toyota 4Runner SR5 Premium 2016. This is a black, metallic black, uh, pretty heavily modified. And uh, so we'll start with the front. It's got the upgraded Toyota TRD Pro grill, uh, Artec Venture bumper. Uh, 30 inch uh, extreme LED light bar and then we've got uh, some factor 55 goodies on there uh, the Haas fair lead that's the one inch uh, factor 55 ultra link and uh, that's all tied into uh, uh, Smitty built winch you can see up in there uh, I've got RCI skids underneath. Uh, that's three piece. Um, what else? The lights are factory stock. And then next is the wheels. This is a KO2 285 7017 method NV305s. Uh, really nice. The suspension is king suspension all around with uh, SPC upper control arms um, it's got the fin remote reservoirs with the, that red button there's the compression adjuster so you can dial back the um, stiffness firmness make it softer firmer um, what else Ski sliders we've got C4 fab sliders these are uh, really sweet bolt-on but do a great job in the rear uh, more compression suspension uh, let's see what else We've got the Expedition 1 bumper uh, this is dual swing out with um, Spare tire on the back, uh, NATO scepter cans, and the Expedition 1 2 jerry can holder. It's also got the ladder uh, so you can get up to the rack, and that's the front runner rack. It's tied in. We've got some Baja Squadron uh, S2 Sport camp lights, chase lights, and uh, couple of attachments for shovels paddles whatever you want to put on there and then this lock is for a table that slides in I don't have the table but there's a mount if you want to add the table in there you can what else um, this side another view of the wheels suspension other side of the bumper this is dual swing out. Super nice. So, all right, I'll open this up. That swings out. Here, there's a latch. Just unhook. Swing that out. It's a uh, Baja Squadron Sport. Um, backup lights. Um, super bright. It's tied into the reverse backup system. It's really nice on uh, dark roads. You can see great. Um, you have here backup camera mount so you can see behind you open this up this is the rear cargo area uh, third row seat delete to accommodate the goose gear uh, drawer system this is full length 300 pounds rated slides holds all your stuff it's really nice 
it's two sides. This is the side-by-side -side drawer module. The dimensions are in the post on forerunner.org. I think it's like 41 by 31 deep, something like that. Um, and eight inch high. So these are really nice. They lock, so you can lock your stuff. So I've got some airline track that I mounted to tie stuff down. Also works great. And then this is a fridge slide, Alucab tilting uh, fridge slide. So, so. Works really well. Go to the back. Uh, let's go around. We'll look inside. Uh, there's a driver's side. Oh, I forgot. Uh, ARB. Uh, this is Safari Snorkel. Works really well, keeps the air take, intake nice and clean. Uh, another view of the rack. You can see that. It's got a couple of mounting points for stratchets here. And uh, also has a uh, tent mount. Uh, those are separate, but I'll include those. All right, we'll take a look inside. It's got the Softex leather and uh, heavy duty floor mats, all weather. This is uh, a ram mount I have. You can switch that out. Uh, heated seats. See that. Uh, on the fly, four wheel drive. Um, AC. This is a Pioneer head unit. This comes out. And um, what else? Sunroof. If you like that. Let's see if I can get in here. Behind the driver's seat. So you can see that view from the cockpit. Sorry, that's not very good. Here we go. A little better. There we go. Pretty clean. Um, I don't know. Glove box. Uh, this is the winch remote and owner's manual. Take a look at the back seat. It's all clean. Good shape. So I'll uh, go around to the other side because I don't think I showed that. <laughs> back like I said super clean pretty clean seats fold down 60 40 split um, I'll go to the other side. Has the flag removed? Took about 10 minutes. Pretty easy. Um, this side. And then just 
pull this down so you can see. Pulls down. I'll move the seat up. I'm pretty tall, so I've got to sit way back. There you go. look under the hood so we've got a few different things here that we've added um, got a LED light bar in the front I'll show you that uh, let's see you can see it's on but I'll show you that uh, rear locker air compressor And we've got uh, camp lights in the back. That's here. Pretty cool. Let's pop the hood. Take a look at that. See our uh, see our light bar that's on. Not too bright because it's light out. Okay. Uh, onboard air. Uh, group 34 battery upgrade. Uh, ARB manifold for the locker. And uh, this is your uh, air output I guess for the compressor of when you want to air up. So that's all that was upgraded in here. But uh, yeah. That's uh that's it. Hopefully that helps. <laughs>